be around you because your energy is so strong. Vibrate so high that anybody that's wishing to do evil upon you, it shall be revealed. Vibrate so high that any evil entity feels uncomfortable in your presence. Yo. Yeah. Everything straight. we are waiting on you. All right. Say less. I got you. Yo, 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 we back at it like crack at it. It's your boy, Balls Cross. Big seal across your heart, man. I appreciate everybody tapping in. I got another one, man. Again, we're going to stay with this whole thing because I'm just curious. Me, like I said, growing up as a Nickelodeon kid and into all that stuff, man, this is just mind-blowing again. And this is what the world need to see. They need to see people getting these things exposed and what we need to look for as parents or anybody to look for, whether you got a niece, nephew, cousin, you know, your mother, father, you need to look at certain signs that they're, they have been putting out there. And we didn't know, you know, kids don't know it. But again, a lot of that comes back when you see some of the parents itself and some of the parents that knew. And my big thing out of this whole Dan Schneider, all this is going on. My question is, Ariana Grande, where are you at? Because you're one of the biggest stars out of the whole group. Now, you got a lot of people from the iCarly show. All of them are starting to come out, or back then they were coming out. So my question is, where's Ariana Grande? Well, I went to start looking, and it's, it's kind of weird when you see some of these scenes I'm going to play, right? And the title says, Dan Schneider made Ariana Grande act out what? So a lot of them, like um, the guy Drake, uh, talked about Drake Bell talked about was the fact that some of the scenes and you, and you heard some of the scenes and Dan Schneider I played that y'all go check that out where he made the response about you know he was so sorry and he felt so bad in all he was doing so blew my mind when I heard that because it kind of you know kind of threw me off so I'm like okay let's keep on looking because again if you dig hard enough you'll find you know what you're looking for because again Everything, and I tell everybody on YouTube, everything is archived. So just because you don't have it up, somebody else might have it titled and a whole different thing. So again, thank God for having this stuff in the archives where we can bring light to it. So on that note, let's get into, and y'all make sure y'all comment about this whole thing. You know, what do y'all think? And I appreciate the comments been coming in too, because again, it's like, man, what do you saw? I heard one person shout out to them and said, what are you sorry for? You know what I'm saying? You shouldn't have never done it. And again, a lot of times these kids are compromised for the beneficial fact for these people to succeed and, and, and you know, live their best life at the cost of somebody else's life. So let's get into it. Let's watch it. Have you ever tried to get your whole big toe in your mouth? Check this out. So, I mean, just look at that. You know what I'm saying? These are... And again, these are teenagers at this time. These are scenes that these are the big scenes Ariana Grande end up getting. You know what I'm saying? That she was doing it. It was all types of rumors that she was not, you know, allegedly she wasn't showing up. She come when she want to. And people didn't understand that. Um, they said, you know, she's, you know, allegedly that, you know, she was very difficult and hard to work. But then you start thinking about what she was subjected to. You know what I'm saying? So let's go it's into it. I mean, think about that. Sometimes I wonder if you can get juice from a potato. See what I'm saying? Now you gotta remember this is Dan Schneider that created the slap. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, you're talking about, you know, a scene for a child is a girl is in her room. And she's trying to see if she can squeeze juice out of a, like, 
Just think about that. Now, now when I'm sitting back and I'm looking at it, I'm like, what in the world? Are you serious? This is what they claimed, like he claimed, Dan claimed, that the writers, the writers wrote for kids. I don't know any kid, especially at that age, would want to sit there and try to do something like that. And she's in her a nightgown. Come on, give up the juice. <gasps> be really, be really cute yeah. and coy with that, because you're a good spy. All right. How how would she be cute? Like, how would you do it if you were being cute? <laughs> oh, that is cute. Can you do that? Can you be as cute as Steve? Uh... <laughs> Look how they looking. They all looking like they want her out of the group to be cute, and they and he's. And that was just in itself was awkward. You see what I'm saying? All of them sitting around and they're using her as, oh, if she falls in line, hey, man, that's, that's Ariana Grande, man. Hey, man, she's a star. She got her own show. That's the goal. We want to come. We're competing with her. <laughs> now look at all these men. Look. Pretty cute, Trip. Pretty cute. Because your uvula is that swingy thing in the back of your throat right here. Look. Is it possible for a teenage girl to drink water upside down? Mmm. I'm thirsty. I mean, just like the the perception and everybody's thinking, like I said, he's got some explaining to do. It ain't over, Dan. I'm sorry. It's not over, man. Because again, this light is being shined and people need to be aware of this. And this is some of the stuff that these, that's why I see why you said um, in your interview, hey, if they don't think it's appropriate, just cut it all out. Cut all the jokes out. Now, again, I said in my last video, where is the joke at? Where is this funny at? Where, where do you find humor at this? It's not possible. <laughs> this morning. Now, my thing is, me, honestly, I really, truly think she was, I, I, man, like, wow. Just, you know, you're talking about the Amanda Bynes. You're talking about all these people that, that you know, and I'm going to do, do something a little bit more on that. Y'all check it out. but. This is crazy, man, when you sit back and look at it. And we're talking about, you know, a lot of times we talk about, like, you got to understand the biggest thing in this world is the exploitation of the youth, right? Whether it be uh, federal charges, whether it be whatever it is. So just think about that. You know, it's that serious. But it's even bigger on bigger scales than we see. Like when Dan said, the guy that, you know, that, with the prison for what he did, the acting coach, he came right out and got a job at Disney. How is that possible? And it's just like the recyclable thing. Maybe it's like, okay, they know how to, I don't know what it is. You know, I really don't know. And it's really just unfortunate, sad, because a lot of them, they, they, their childhood was robbed and they, they can't get that back. And then now they have to relive it, but hope, believe in hope and the people believe that it's bigger than this and it ain't just oh i'm just saying this because i need this and i'm saying this it's like some kids probably went through that and who are, who are we to say that you know hey they but a lot of them again had parents like you said had grooming coaches or the coaches over there on the set adults like you saw it was a whole bunch of people around there so i just think that's crazy morning, i was taking out the garbage and i found a dirty cat a dirty cat. So we're going to bathe that cat. This is Cat. Hi! Tell him what's going to happen now, Cat. I'm going to get bathed. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yeah, this is crazy, bro. And the reason why y'all probably wanted like, wow, 
There's, there's no laughing. Oh, my gosh, Sam would be different. No, he's going to do what? No, he's going to do what? Oh, Don't Sam, the, cat is not oh. Oh. the most important qualities when you're picking a boyfriend are um <laughs> No, I can't say that. He should be really nice and smart and that's all that matters. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Like, that's crazy. So you're on the set, people standing around, you got a dress. Uh, and this is the scene where Dan, uh, the the one girl, no, one, the, one of the actress, young actress, noticed Dan was walking up and he's the one filming. She pulled, she pulled Ariana's dress down. You know what I'm saying? Cut that out! Look, I'm a grown, I'm a grown man standing around Gawking at this 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 girl at that time. That was amazing. That was one of the better things I've ever heard. Hey. Hi. What's going on here? Nothing. You didn't cut out that part. Why are you sitting on the floor of the set? Because we are. I just turned sixteen, which means that I'm one of the youngest kids in my class, but I'm mature, so whatever you know. <laughs> Man, that right there is very disturbing. So, like I said again, I took away the laugh box of it because I wanted it. I wanted people to see it. Now, where is that funny at? Those are supposed to have been the funny, famous scenes of Ariel Ariel Grande. So, where was that funny? If you take the laugh away, right? Like even Cat Williams said, if you have to do something compromising, when it, how is that funny? At, because it's at your expense. So, again, man. I just wanted to bring this to y'all. I want y'all to see this video, man. Y'all make sure y'all share, comment, subscribe. Y'all tell me what you think, man. Very, very suspect type of activity. And Dan, I understand now. And it's way more. Think about it. There are way more because he said there's way more people that didn't like working with me than did. So now all you got to do is find the people that didn't like to work. And then they all going to have the same pattern. Like I said, those guys did not want to do the show when they became an adult because they didn't put him out the set. He said he didn't get banned from his own set. Well, my the way I look at it, I think you did. I feel like you did because at the same time, it's a lot of stuff that you did that just doesn't make sense. And there were way more men around. There weren't enough women to protect some of these girls. And again, this girl is getting all this attention. They say she came from a very well-off family, so we don't know what the history could be. But we do know she had all these hit shows. She goes on to do all these things, these songs and everything. And it all came from there. So y'all tell me what you think, man. And, um, you know, do you think, um, you know, um, is there some hidden secrets to this? Um, is there more about to come out? Um, were you shocked? Does it make sense? There's a lot of questions to be asked. So y'all just tell me what y'all think, man. And y'all holler at your boy. You've been plugged in with the Plug Podcast. Peace.